Hi, this is Donna Jean Newport with the Brodkin Group at Home Connect America, license number S like Sam 0184826. We are standing at 3698 Greencrest Drive here in Las Vegas. This property is located where there is no HOA. This home is on 13,500 square feet. The home itself is 2,700 square feet. It is a four bedroom, three bath, and it also has a very large swimming pool that is 12 feet deep. The property also has very mature landscaping. It also has very upgraded crown molding throughout. It has stone floors throughout most of the home. The bedrooms have real wood floors. The bathrooms have marble. The home itself does have a suppression system, which is sprinklers that will drop down if there's ever a fire in the home. The home is fully alarmed and there are no contracts. It does convey over with the property. It was put in by ADT and it also has motions and they have stuff on the window. So if someone were to break in through the window, you would know about it. The home itself does have pot shelves throughout the dining room and the kitchen. It also does come with all of the appliances, stainless steel made by Frigidaire. Also comes with a GE washer and dryer. And the fireplace that stands in the middle of the home is fully wired so that you could put a TV up there without having to string cords everywhere. Also, on a push of a button, you can turn on your fireplace. And another really nice feature that this home has, this home has a fireplace that shares the master bathroom and the master bedroom. So if you want to have that romantic evening, there you go. Also, there are southern style shutters throughout this home, uh, which is a really nice amenity. You don't have to worry about having to put up drapes and all that stuff. This home has so much lighting. It actually has uh, two sets of sliding doors. It has a set of sliding doors in the living room and in the master bedroom. The home itself does have ground, granite countertops. It has a kitchen nook. Look at that. It also has very lovely pot shelves. So if you're like me and you like to display your beautiful glass or something else that's quite lovely, well, there you go. Now, every bedroom in here, including the living room, has a really nice size fan for lights. And it has one vaulted ceiling located in the living room, but all the other ceilings look to be about 10 feet with recessed lighting in the kitchen and a few other areas here in the home. You got a bathroom that's located to go outside so that when your pool guests come over, they're not going to be soaking your entire house. Here's the hardwood floors. This is not laminate. This is real hardwood. This is bedroom number one, as I said, fan, lights. Here's the Jack and Jill restroom that is between bedroom uh, two and three. We have marble. All the bathrooms have that. Bedroom number two, fan and lights. When you come out, bedroom number two and three, which I would presume would be for children or guests, it's on the other end of the house away from the master bedroom. So you kind of have your own little hidden retreat. Lots of storage. We're going to just sort of pan around when you come off of the end of the house here where we have the washer and dryer and the kids room or guest room. This is what you'll see. Dining room through there, foyer through here. Beautiful view of very fully matured landscaping out back. Here is the master bedroom. I was telling you about the central vac system. Plug in in any one of these little goodies. Have a vacuum cleaner hose that's located in the main closet. Here is 
is the master retreat. Isn't this gorgeous? And if you have those open, you're going to have even more light in here. Another little area to put goodies. I'm thinking this. they must have built this house for me because I really love it. That fireplace I was telling you about. And look at all this marble. It goes up the side of the tub and through the shower. It's just a beautiful area. What they did in here is quite lovely. This is the master bathroom. Got your own private little commode. Your walk-in closet. This home, the gentleman who custom built this home, he really did build it with an aim for pleasing whomever was lucky enough to get it. Lots of space. This one here, blankets to the ceiling, all the other stuff down there. Look at that. We're gonna take a little trip right on outside here. Again, no HOA. This home, if you were to put just, say you didn't put but maybe three, three to five percent down, you'd probably be looking at a payment of about three thousand a month. So of course, again, that's something that a lender can help you with. And if you need help, I'll be more than happy to send you a couple of lenders to choose from. As you can see, we have gorgeous growth throughout this whole backyard. Is this not the most beautiful thing that you've ever seen? I mean, if you want serenity, here you go. I mean, you have nature in your backyard. And I have seen so many hummingbirds in this home. This is just the backyard. I haven't even showed you the front yard. Which, unfortunately, my luck with videotaping today has not been good. So, <laughs> we also have a oh, about a 50-gallon uh, propane tank that will take care of... Hi! <laughs> and one of my lovely uh, gals wanting to come and look at the house right now. Hi, Callie! Hi. I'm going to say goodbye, and you have a lovely rest of your day. Bye-bye.